Barberville Independent Schools have received a new high-tech school bus. Colleen Finney explains how this came to be. Barberville Independent Schools are trying to be cleaner by getting rid of a diesel bus and replacing it with an all-electric one. This is made possible through an EPA grant that the principal applied for in August. Most of that cost is covered by the grant, making it possible for the district to use the extra money to deck the bus out with every feature possible. This, is, this grant allowed us to spend some more and uh, put features on there, and we added almost everything you could add to a bus, so the grant helped tremendously. The electric bus will cost around $440,000. The bus will be used for short trips as it can go 130 miles on a full charge. The district plans to save money by paying $40 to $80 to charge every month compared to three to $400 every fill up. When you're a small district, funds can be limited and have this opportunity to get a bus at this price, electric or gas, is a big advantage for our district in replacing our bus and putting a a newer bus on the road for our students is something everyone is excited about. The community has expressed mixed feedback towards the new bus, but the school says students will be safer on the electric bus compared to the diesel one that's been running routes for 20 plus years. This bus, this bus being a newer bus, is uh, has all the safety features they put on it. It has cameras 360 degree around the bus, has a camera on the stop arm, which we do not have at the present time, so all the modern technology is on this bus, and uh, we feel like this will be a better bus on the road. Barberville Independent Schools will receive the new bus next summer. They're expecting to get a version to test drive in the meantime. Colleen Finney, Fox 56 News.